Hello everyone, Picklebee here, and welcome back to another quick video. This is an updated tutorial for my Super Smash Bros. world. Don't mind that over there, that's something that hasn't worked, so I'm not even going to bother going into that. But I've added a couple things. I've added, maybe this was in my last update, maybe not for the tutorial, but I added a... Ooh, excuse me. I added a boss fight. These are just the randomizers for it, so in case you were wondering what those are. I guess I just have enough dirt at the time, but well, yeah, I have greatly improved on this. I haven't added any new levels or anything since the last time I uh, updated this on Planet Minecraft, or any new characters, except maybe. Uh, oh yeah, um, I had one person, uh, one of my friends, when I went to camp, uh, Lord of the Cupcake. Ooh, he's got a new skin now. Nice. But anyway, um, I added him. That's really the only character or place I've added. And there's a boss fight here. Like as you can see on the side, I only have zero. I said I don't have one. I have zero wins, so you need twenty to fight it. But if you are here for the controls, I actually missed something that I realized people weren't doing when I watched them play. Like not online, just at my friend's house stuff. So first I'll do the controls, the options, controls, scroll all the way down. These would normally say 9, 8, 7, and 6. So you'd want to click it, press the up arrow, the right arrow, left arrow, and down arrow. But then again you can change these to whatever you want. This is you actually moving, going up, right, and left. Um, 4 and 5 is shoot and hit. If you want to change those, you can. Uh, two is your smash ability, so if you want to change that, go ahead. And one is just your stop game. If you want to change these, go right ahead. Uh, you don't have to do any of these controls here, but I just find these easier. Maybe you will as well. So, and then what other people are doing. Uh, the reason mine wasn't lagging so hard was because I have this set up. Now I'm not going to be looking at each one of them, I'm only going to be talking about one of them, but this actually makes your Minecraft go faster. So if you want to know how to do that, actually that should be all, uh, if you want to know how to do that, go right ahead, look at this, copy it, but the one I want to talk about is particles. Uh, apparently when I made this, uh, I had my particles on decreased and I didn't know it at the time so I thought that was the normal amount. When I went over to my friend's house, he had had particles on uh, all, oops, all, and that really lagged the computer. So you can either have them a decreased or miminal, miminal, yeah, I can't talk. But uh, unless you have a really good computer and you really want to do all, but I wouldn't really recommend it. I go with decreased, so yeah. But if you want any of these others, clouds, those don't help with going your computer faster. I just personally don't like this. But uh, now let's get into the new stuff that I've added. Um, what I realized that I didn't really show was my custom levels. I do have these back here, back in the corner, so if no one saw them, I guess you didn't see them. They're all the way back here. You could just build and create your own levels. It shows you like what blocks I use behind it to like make certain stuff happen like for example for this one gold jumping blocks uh, the emerald blocks in the front allow you to um, just break and fall the iron well anyway I'm I'm by myself but I'm gonna show you what new things that I've added I'll just be me this person wants to be blank so Um, I'll show you in the diamond skylines. This pr it's probably the easiest one to show you it in. I've added uh, jump backs. So, well, if, if you haven't seen this before, this is the game. This is what it looks like. It's really only where your head is that it kind of cuts off. But other than that, it shows the entire screen. As you can tell, I cannot move at all. Um, so, walk around. Uh, so, like if I shoot someone at something, 
know, something at someone, it will knock them back. And you would just keep doing it until they fall off, I guess. And then they fall. Goodbye, player two. It only gets rid of ten. When I hit this guy, it also bounces back. So you just bam, 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 bam. That's probably the farthest away you can hit them. Bam. And it's not just for that direction. Like if I'm facing this way, I can hit them that way. Bam. Uh, yeah. That's pretty much it. If you guys want me to add anything, please put that in the description below. Or if you're watching this on Planet Minecraft, please comment uh, anything, just as long as it's not inappropriate, please. So, uh, yeah. Thanks for watching. I'm Pickle P, and I'm about to kill player two. In a second. Right now. I'm amazing. I've also found this glitch, but... Oh, yes, if you find glitches, please tell me. Tell me what they are. You don't have to tell me why they're happening, because I will figure that out. Just tell me that they are happening. If it's with a character, tell which character it is. If, if it's the characters like Smash, tell me the character. Tell me, if you, tell me if you were playing as player 1 or player 2, because I found a couple of glitches already with Samus where player 2's didn't work, but player 1's did. So please tell me if you find anything like that. And now, I will see you in my next video. Bye. And... Mic drop. Except I'm the person. Bye.